Hi guys, my name is Mars. I'm an art college dropout from Portland, Oregon. Uh, I think I'm an ENFP, but I don't know what that means. My current running webcomic is called Long Exposure, and that's what I'm going to talk about today. Long Exposure is about a nerd and a bully that's been in love with him since they were kids. The two accidentally get superpowers and get in a bunch of trouble together. I started making comics back in grade school because I hated doing classwork and I wanted to draw instead. Uh, I started making webcomics in early high school, I think, um, which was inspired by uh, a lot of like wolf and dog comics online, which were so cool then and I think they're really cool now. I first started Long Exposure um, back in early 2016. Um, I didn't actually start the comic until September that year, but um, early on I was just making uh, the characters um, because I just wanted to make some characters for fun and people liked them, I guess, and I was bullied into making a webcomic. <laughs> but I'm really glad that I did. Um, the story is a mix of all this random stuff that I was really into at the time, like different movies and games, and even music was all really inspiring. Um, I knew for a long time that I wanted to make some really stupid idiot characters with superpowers that should absolutely not have superpowers, um, and I've been wanting characters like that for a while. So um, after I made the characters' backstories, the plot just kind of developed on its own. Um, I've been asked before if Mitch and Jonas are based on real people I know, and the answer is no, thank god. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> My favorite part about being a comic creator is um, when people ask me what I do for a living, and I tell them, and they get this look on their face that looks like they feel really bad for me, and uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty awesome. Being a member of the LGBT community has influenced me as a creator and my storytelling in the following ways. Uh, my comic is gay. The coolest thing that's happened to me as a creator has probably been um, when I was able to quit my job and make comics instead um, because working sucks. My advice for people wanting to start making webcomics is to just start. Don't wait until your art is better or whatever, just jump in and let yourself improve through making a comic. I think one of the best parts about making a webcomic is being able to see your art develop and improve in real time over the pages, uh, and I totally encourage not going back to edit old pages to update the art for that reason. The final chapter of Long Exposure begins July 4th, which has been rebranded from America Day to Long Exposure Day. Uh, new pages are already up on my Patreon right now. Uh, Black Lives Matter, ACAB, and thank you so much for listening.